The wet weather has activated two main landslides, one off Highway 36 toward Mapleton, the other on Highway 126 east of Vida. KEZI 9 News reporter Jessica Debus joins us live from Highway 126 with more. Jessica? That's right. Highway 126 is still closed between Vida that landslide, but it's expected to reopen in about a half an hour here all day. Experts have been assessing the danger of those slides and trying to find the best way to prevent more from happening. Worries were still high Friday morning that this hillside was too unstable after a landslide closed Highway 126. There's a lot of weight on the hillside like that when it's wet like that. There's a lot of trees that fall over. That's why transportation managers called in 78 year old tree trimmer Monty Ramp. When they have danger trees, they call me. Ramp has been doing timber work for several different local agencies for 50 years. So transportation managers know he can get the job done with nothing but his chainsaw. You're just going to climb up there? Sure. Unless you carry me. <laughs> Ramp climbs up the hill, cutting down the trees that could reactivate the landslide. He does it strategically so he doesn't end up ever going down with it. Don't go underneath it. You go one side and come back to it. Like Ramp, residents around the area don't seem too concerned about the slide. I think it's kind of typical when you're out here. The soil gets saturated and trees come down. You can't maintain everything that nature grows. So if rocks or gravel or even the high water comes over the road, you just have to drive carefully. They say all you can do is work around the weather and be ready for any natural disaster. They do their best maintaining the road and we should just be prepared for it every single winter.